Hey guys, today we are going to fix Windows error 1053. The service does not respond to the start or control request in a timely fashion. You get this error when you are trying to launch some game or third party application on Windows computer. This error can be caused because of timeout setting, missing DLL, corrupted system files or missing frameworks. In this video, we will cover how to fix this issue on Windows. Let's dive right into it. To fix this issue, we will first change the timeout settings in the registry. For that, you need to go in search bar and write R-E-G-E-D-I-T. So it will bring up registry editor. Just right click on registry editor and run as administrator and click yes to get administrator access. Okay, once you are in your registry, you need to go to the local machine and then go to system, then go to current control set here and then control. Just go in control. Just click on control here. You don't have to open it. Just click on control. Right click new D word 32 bit value. Click here. Rename this file with the name service pips timeout. Uh, this name will be in description in case you want to copy and paste and click anywhere. Once you have done that, double click on it and you will be able to modify the value. In the value column, just put 181800 and make sure this option is selected and click OK. Once you do that, respawn time for the window for any software to open will be increased. So if some software is taking too much time to open, it will get time and you won't get that error. Second thing we will do, we will check the system corrupted files. For that, we need to go in search again and type CMD and click on a command prompt and click right click and run as administrator. Yes. In this, we will do a system scan. For the uh, system scan, command will be in the description. You can copy and paste this command from the description and hit enter. Once you do that, system will run a scan and if there is some corrupted file, it will fix them. Once system scan start running, it will take some time maybe up to 10 to 15 minutes depending upon your system uh, hardware. Once system scan is complete you need to restart your computer. Before restarting your computer you can run this another command which will be available in the description. Right click here and paste the command. Once the command is there press enter. This command may take some time so I will skip this video. Once the command is completed, you need to restart your computer. Once you restart your computer, the error 1053 should be fixed. And make sure you update your window to the latest version. Sometimes the update for the window also caused this error. To update the window, you just need to simply go in start and go in search and do update and it will say check for update just click here and you will get this option here you will get an option of download window will download the update and it will ask you to restart your computer you restart your computer and the problem should be fixed hope this video helps you out guys if this video helps you out guys please do like and subscribe my channel it helps me a lot thank you thank you for watching my video